today assisting you with this review, I have Brandon, and today we're going to be doing a pistol review of the SOCOM Gear M9. Okay, so first we're going to be talking about the features. These features include a threaded barrel, Picatinny rail mount, functioning slide catch and release. Please note that when the gun has fired its last shot, slide will lock back and you hit the slide release. This gun features a 23 round, 23 round metal magazine that runs on green gas, a lanyard hook, one thing I did forget to mention are um, the ambidextrous safeties. And also this gun does feature a right-handed mag release, like on all other mines. Plus, very visible iron sights. So now we're going to be doing a teardown of the M9 and a breakdown of the parts. First thing you do, obviously, take out your magazine. And to disassemble the gun, press this button right here and hold it down. Next, pull down this lever. Now release the button on the back. Then simply slide the slide off the frame. So now that we have our gun disassembled, let's talk about each individual part. For the upper receiver, the entire slide is made out of metal. The barrel is made out of metal, and all the functioning parts on this are made out of metal. These include ambidextrous safety, slide release, mag release, and hammer. Now let's talk about the lower receiver. Everything on the lower receiver is made out of high quality metal, with the exception of the grip plates. The entire frame is made out of one solid chunk of high quality metal. To reassemble, simply slide your slide back on the lower frame and pull the lever down. Your M9 is now reassembled. Okay, so this test is going to be conducted with 20 gram BBs. Weird. There we go. There we go. There was something inside of it. Alright, now we're going to do a accuracy test from 25 feet and we're going to be using 20 gram BBs and we're going to shoot the full mag which is 24 rounds and see what the grouping is. Okay, so now we're going to be discussing the results of the accuracy test. Please note that uh, we weren't really necessarily aiming for the bullseye. We're just going to be um, talking about the grouping of the handgun. And as you can see right now, it is actually really good. Here, for reference, here's a quarter. And um, it is hard to tell how many shots actually hit the paper out of 24 shots, but um, I can approximate about 20 hit the target. Um, see, we've got one graze right there, maybe a couple hit up top over here. but so. Um, that would be the accuracy of the SOCOM Gear M9. So in conclusion, the SOCOM Gear M9 is a very solid, very high quality handgun. I would give this gun a solid 8.5 out of 10 due to the fact that all the parts in the gun are made out of extremely high quality metal and those that are not are made out of extremely high quality polymer. The only downsides to this I see are the lack of um, ambidextrous mag release and the non-functioning double action trigger that does not function when firing rounds. So guys I hope you enjoyed this M9 review. My name is Matt and I had Brandon assisting me today and I'll see you guys later.